What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Currently doing some breastfeeding. We are in the car and we are on a road trip to go for like a little weekend getaway. We've been trying to get away. We'll go on like a little vacation for quite a while now. Honestly, before even Kofa was born, we were trying to get away and we couldn't. But now we're going for a little weekend getaway and we're going to Lake Placid just to kind of chill, relax, get in the mountains, get into nature and all that jazz. But before we get there, we are currently at one of my favorite places, Target. I love Target. I just, we had to make a quick pit stop before we got to Lake Placid, of course. Hi, buddy. We have finally made it to our hotel. As you guys can see, we have our beds there. And well, the bathroom's over there. How cute is this place? It is so cute. It has like this woodsy kind of lodge, cottage kind of feeling, which is really nice. I don't know. I really like it. Something that's really funny or weird. I don't know. This is weird to me. Maybe it might be normal to you, but if you turn on the TV in here, so I turned on the TV here and if you go into the bathroom, so if you come in the bathroom, you have the TV volume. Mind turning it up, Dave? So we can listen to it in here. So while you're going to the bathroom, you can still listen to the TV. You can't, you don't have to miss a second. Nope, <laughs> it's so funny. Look how beautiful this is, guys. Wow. So beautiful. Tonight for supper, we have some chipotle, literally my favorite. We have brown rice, veggies, sofrita, corn, mild with guac, literally the best. And David has a giant burrito. back now as you guys can obviously see behind me and it was really nice to just mentally get away I didn't film that much after like the first day just because we went to mentally reset and we were just really relaxing chilling we went to the pool a little bit we walked around quite a bit and it was just really nice to just reset mentally and just kind of step out of our environment because it has been very stressful like with COVID and everything like being a parent and that kind of shift has been really hard and I know a lot of you can completely understand that and I must say like I feel very lucky that we were able to kind of go away for the weekend cope was actually really good I was really worried about it because a lot of people are like when you go away your kid like has such a hard time sleeping and cope was actually really good and we're so lucky with him like I'm so grateful for him he's such a really good kid even though sometimes it is really hard but besides that we had a really good time and I'm really really happy about that however there's something I really wanted to talk about um because when I was shopping at Target like that was the first time that I've like really done a big haul and also going away and going swimming and things like that. That was the first time of me putting on like putting on a bikini and wearing it out in public. And honestly, it was really, really hard. So when we first like we went to Target before we went to our hotel because it was like on the way to where we were going and and I tried on a lot of activewear for a TikTok, which should be up by now. So if you guys want to, you can follow me on TikTok. But I tried on a lot of activewear and I tried on a lot of bathing suits because a lot of my old bathing suits don't fit me except for one bathing suit. So I was like, okay, I'll try some on. And I couldn't figure out my size because usually before I was pregnant, I was like about a medium, sometimes a large, depending on the style of bathing suit. Um, but now my body has changed a lot and trying them on, it was really hard like I couldn't figure out my size like I really like tried on medium large and extra large and almost none of them well pretty much none of them fit me except for one bathing suit and when I put it on it was a little like I guess less coverage it was like a string bikini I guess you can say and I felt so uncomfortable in it and it was really hard to like kind of show off my new body like I've been trying to accept my body and I've learned to accept my body in a lot of my activewear items, but trying on the bathing suits was really, really hard, especially when they weren't fitting. And I was also feeling discouraged because I was trying on a lot of activewear because before activewear, I'd fit in like a medium and a large. And a lot of the activewear was not fitting me as well. Like I got some pieces like this, which I find really cool, but obviously I'm not going to work out in it because it's only one strap. But I was trying on like tons of activewear and it was 
not fitting at all and I was having a really hard time. I found a couple pieces, but like this was like the first time that I was actually trying on a huge haul of clothes to see what fits me. And it was quite a struggle because like a lot of times I'd be like, oh, I could wear this in a medium and now I couldn't even wear it in an extra large. Or like I would fit into a large and then it would be too big on me. And then it was just like, I know Target, a lot of their sizing is inconsistent for sure. But it was just really like, I was having a hard time mentally. Like after that, I was like, wow, I really like wanted to try on all these clothes to kind of reset my wardrobe because my body has changed. And it was really just like not great at the end of the day. Like I just didn't feel really great at, after that. And when we got to the hotel, there was a pool there and I was like all excited because I was like, yeah, I really want to go swimming because it feels really good because my, my back has been hurting and I really just want to just chill in the pool a little bit. And I put on my bathing suit and when I went out into public, I like at first I was like, okay, I feel confident, I'm feeling good. And then I went out into public and I felt so insecure. Like I didn't realize how insecure I'd feel. Like I've never been 100% confident in my bathing suit, I must admit. But there's times where I'm like, you know what? I love my body and I feel good. But putting on a bathing suit and going out into public postpartum was like quite a struggle. Cause like I have a lot of stretch marks on the front of my stomach. And yes, my bathing suit did cover it up, but I didn't cover it up fully. So that was really hard and just how my stomach has changed, how my legs have changed, how my body has changed. A lot of things don't fit my boobs because I'm breastfeeding and funny enough, like you can't really tell here, but I do have really uneven boobs right now with breastfeeding because one boob produces more milk than the other. And that has been starting to become an insecurity of mine because of the uneven um, unevenness of my boobs. And I just like started nitpicking at my body so much and I couldn't believe how much I was nitpicking. And I kind of had to like step back and reset myself mentally and be like, Nicole, your body has changed for a good reason. You gave birth to a beautiful little boy. And I had to kind of like take time to think about it and mentally reset about it. And I talked to David about it and it was really nice because he's really encouraging and he's he lets me vent about these things and kind of changes my perspective, which is really nice. So it was really nice to just talk to him about that. And after I was feeling a lot more confident in the bathing suit, but at first it was really hard. And I know a lot of women deal with this postpartum because the body has changed so much. And you know, a lot of women gain more stretch marks. Like I've had stretch marks before, but now I have new stretch marks in the front and I have some on the side. So it was a bit different, but I know a lot of women, when, like I said, when they get pregnant, they gain stretch marks, cellulite, their body has changed. So it is hard for a lot of women to mentally adjust when going into a bathing suit and they don't feel 100% confident. And I just wanna share that, like I did not feel confident whatsoever. I took pictures after, after I talked to David, after I like kind of changed my mind, changed my perspective on how I was feeling in my bathing suit. And I felt way more confident. I didn't feel 100% confident. I definitely still have some things that I need to work through and definitely with body image and body image after pregnancy, it is always gonna be up and down, up and down and it's a journey, not like an end destination. So I'm getting used to my body and I'm trying to get used to it and I just wanna share with you guys that like, even though I may look confident in some photos and things like that, there's still that mental struggle behind it. Like. I'm, I feel confident at some points, but some points I feel really insecure. Like I felt okay when I first put on the bathing suit, but then I felt insecure when I went out into public. And same thing when I was trying on clothes, I felt confident in some clothes like this one. I was like, wow, this really shows off my shoulders. But when I was trying on all those bathing suits, I felt like so insecure, especially if they weren't fully covering up my stretch marks and they weren't fully covering up like a lot of my legs and things like that. So it was really, hard in that aspect but I know it's not always me when it comes to wearing the clothes like when I put on clothes and they don't fit me it's not my body's fault it is definitely like the clothes like just the clothes don't feel great and obviously like these are really fast cheaply made clothes and they don't always fit every single body so of course it might not fit my body in general and that is okay and I need to remind myself that and I need to appreciate the things that do fit my body that I love where it shows off my muscles and all those things like that is what I need to learn to appreciate and focus on is enjoy the things that fit me and not 
worry or dwell on the things that don't fit me. So yes, I know this is a little bit of a ramble, but I felt like I really needed to share that because I know everyone struggles with body image and I definitely do, even though I might feel confident at times, there are times where I really, really struggle. And this was just one of those times where I did struggle with my body. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was a bit of ramble, but I feel like I needed to share these things. Anyways, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. It really helps the channel. Also, don't forget to shop my Be Unstoppable merch. It is in the link down below. Please check it out. And it also, all the prices are in Canadian. So if you are in the US, it is technically cheaper for you guys, FYI. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to be unstoppable. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Summer days burn me out, love just brings me down Go inside like when she leaves, I slowly leave the ground Hey, you come back, I wanna give you a chance Love me like you used to, so we can learn again The skin is getting round me